what's the worst trend going on in your country? Vaccine hesitancy. We're about to lose our measles eradication status. People aren't vaccinating their dogs because they're afraid the dogs will get autism seriously. And rabies risk is consequently going up. Where people can afford healthcare and have access to emergency care. People are readily exposing themselves and others to deadly diseases because they did their research by listening to a bad podcast. This is in the US. BTW. Roadman drill culture for sure. The original road culture comes from from impoverished black communities of the inner city. What we have today is every fucking kid with daddy issues pretending to be some type of driller. Ho to literally any town or city in this country without seeing a bunch of teenage boys masked up in balaclavas ready to rob a store or get angry at you for looking at their direction for a millisecond. Your universal healthcare so that its foundations are becoming worse and worse forcing many people to seek private healthcare instead basically building the case that the citizens prefer private HC. Meanwhile the universal was the real preference it's just forcing consent into a worse system that less than a tenth of citizens would even be able to afford. The Irish mogger G-O-B-S-H-I-T-E-T-E or Y dot dot. And while we are here dot 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 tea into the two Muppets in the European Parliament and there's our new Dowsich who looks like he's slimed out of a hackfish's asshole, which strangely is exactly where the last guy can fuck off back to. Can't choose between point one Margaism and its various toxic comorbidities including anti-vax, religious infiltration of schools and state govs, forced birth, and destroying the environment to own the libs. 2. People weaving through traffic at 110 miles per hour or abusing strangers for TikTok clout. Motherfuckers on electric bikes, with the rate of speed, lack of training certification, and lack of helmets they are more dangerous than motorcycles. The death ratio makes them more dangerous than motorcycles. Let that sink in. Main character syndrome by millennials Gen Z consumed by too much social media. They think every problem they have is unique. That they are worthy of praise and concern. And that their voice matters over anyone else. The rate of people being killed by drop bears here in Australia has increased dramatically this year. Despite the drop bear related deaths last year already being at a record high level. Spapeso. Mexicans that work abroad send home remittances to their families. But with the peso being so strong, the MX families get less for their money. Not a new trend per se. At the UK government ATM are trying to pass laws to fine homeless people thousands of pounds. For being homeless, it's awful. They went the long way to legalising drugs and reducing penalties for crime over the last 10 years and you can guess how that turned out. It's pretty much impossible to build new housing units in Canada. With the rise of the population, the housing prices are exploding. I think it started in Korea. A here in Taiwan people will watch those videos of a girl eating a shitload of food on camera. People have said cost of living and housing. So I'll say drug use. Especially meth. Meth is quite a problem where I live. Being the grandest supporter of a current genocide as the nation who themselves committed one just this last century. Fixing to abandon democracy is all. Don't laugh at us around the world. The splash zone will be considerable. The very clear war of grocery stores versus people who need groceries in any affordable way at all in order to live. Rental crisis. Scummy landlords charging ridiculous prices for shacks of mould and landlords refusing peps. Folks are going viral for posting other people's videos and contributing nothing but staring at the camera. Becoming more like America and idolising Trump. Like, if you love him so much, go live there you idiot. We have somehow watched the last 10 years of American shit show and decided we should copy that. Nationalism Scotland has turned the country into a bickering, whiny, incompetent shithole. People hating the leaders so much they aren't able to have a rational thought about politics. A particular religion is working hard to turn our democracy into a theocracy. Only being able to water our lawn three days a week because of fear of a drought. Fascism and the importation of US-style reggae politics 
via social media, the enablement of hard drug use in hospitals with no repercussions, the lack of affordable housing, decent wages and family doctors, the crumbling brand mauer, Germans have it with crumbling walls, saying elections are rigged every time they don't go your way, the party of small government goose stepping towards fascism, convincing children that they were born in the wrong body, hard to choose between the transphobia and the gun violence, average price for Hegs has risen for 20 this year Russia, America, it's the worst trend, America, yes, I live here. Homelessness and addiction are becoming way too common. Political polarization, US also income inequality.